Zentangle illustrations, what are they? Well, they look something like this. This is just a quick one that I did and use as a reference for the tutorials. Used a line art drawing of an elephant and you can see that, let me um, unlock the line art here. You can see that I created or sketched with the pen tool a bunch of little parts of the elephant so that then I could fill them in with my custom Zentangle swatches. And I got a nice thick black stroke all the way around the edge, all the way around the outside, which is what we want. We want a variety of patterns, no strokes on the inside shapes, but a stroke along the outside. So how did I do that? Let me um, turn the eyeballs off on these two layers, right? I have this reference photo here, it should be locked which I'm going to show you in the next tutorial um, how to download. I don't want you to do this elephant. I want you to do your own animal, but this is just to kind of show you what it's supposed to look like. So we have that guy. Then I pin tooled him, right? If I turn the visibility off of the reference layer and I have this layer called outline, I just pin tooled an outside outline of everything. So I can have a nice thick black stroke. Let me turn that one off. I'm going to turn on the line art and unlock it. Then you can see that I did a bunch of different shapes and then I, I pin tooled them and then I filled them in with my different patterns. So it's going to give you some pin tool practice. Then you're going to fill it in with your patterns. A little tricky, but not too bad, not too bad. Next tutorial, I'll show you how to get started with it.